Facebook ads are changing the way small and local businesses are reaching their ideal audiences through new updates, features and tools that Facebook continues to roll out. These changes allow small businesses to get the most out of Facebook ads. Hey team, Stuart here, welcome back. I hope everyone is well. Today I'm going to share with you invaluable Facebook ad strategies as well as new Facebook updates and marketing tools that you can use in order to craft highly profitable Facebook ads for your small business. Right now is the best time to launch your Facebook ads as everyone's attention, including your audiences, are on social media. Today, I wanna make sure that you have the most up-to-date information for creating highly profitable Facebook ads in 2020. Now, before we get started, and if you're new to this channel, consider subscribing and tapping the bell icon, and that way you'll stay updated with new and actionable videos designed to help your small and local business thrive online. All right, with that covered, let's jump into it. All right, now when you first get started with Facebook ads, it's hard to know what images, videos, or copy are gonna be most effective and profitable. Now the great thing about Facebook, and as of recently, they are now required to be as transparent as possible to the public, which means you have complete access to your competitors' Facebook ads. You can spy and check on their Facebook ads and see and determine which ones have been performing the best for them, which in turn will help you with ideas in creating your own profitable Facebook ads. Now the name of this tool in order to spy on our competitors is called the Facebook Ads Library. To check out what ads your competitors are running, head over to Facebook and find a competitor's Facebook page. Once you're on their page, navigate down to the right hand side of the Facebook page and click see more next to page transparency. Then navigate down to ads from this page. This will tell you if this page is running any ads. Then click go to ad library. Here you can see all the ads that are currently running as well as the text, images and videos that your competitors are using. Here you want to identify the longest running ads as these ads are typically the highest performing ads. Then what you want to do is build your ads similar to these and aim to make your ads better than your competition. All right, next we wanna look at a Facebook ads feature that has recently been launched, which makes Facebook ad testing a breeze. Rather than individually testing each ad within each ad set, which includes videos, images, and ad copy, you can simply use dynamic creative content. When you're creating your Facebook ad and after you've created your campaign and within your ad set level, you can actually turn on dynamic creative. And this means when you're at the ad level, you can actually select up to 10 in images or videos and Facebook will dynamically show and test the different images video combinations with your primary text headline and description combinations that you've created this way you can leave all the split testing up to Facebook without having to create dozens of ads to test yourself just plug in all the information and away you go Next, we wanna discuss audience insights and identify your audience that's most likely going to buy from or interact with your Facebook ads. Within audience insights, you can create your ideal audience. All you need to do is select your targeted country and then under interests, type in what your audience is interested in. For example, if I was selling men's jewelry, I would click shopping and fashion, then fashion accessories and select jewelry. Then you can see that under age and gender that I would want to target men between 25 and 44 as this is the largest male audience most interested in jewelry. And you can do this with other interests and more advanced targeting if you have a good idea of who your audience is. Once you've done some research, you can also save this audience for later on. Then what we want to do is head back to your ad set level and navigate down to audience. Here you can add your saved audience that we just created before from Audience Insights or we can create from scratch. If we decide to start from scratch, remember we want to target men between 25 and 44 from the research we did earlier in Audience Insights. So we can change that here and click Jewelry. Then if we want to target those that are more likely to buy from us, then we want to select Engaged Shoppers. This is a powerful targeting strategy, as these are people that have clicked shop now on other Facebook ads in the past week. This will make your ads more profitable as you're targeting people that are most likely to buy. 
And finally, the last Facebook ads activity that I want to go through today, which is vital in creating profitable Facebook ads, is creating engaging content. You might have a compelling call to action ad copy, but if your images and videos on your ads do not represent your brand, your message, or they're just plain ugly, outdated, or spammy, then your Facebook ads are simply not going to perform and convert. Therefore, I want to share with you two Facebook ad design tools that you can use to create engaging Facebook content for your ads. The first tool is called canva.com. The link is in the description below and that will take you to Canva's dashboard. And all you need to do is click here and type Facebook ad and then click Facebook ad and start creating your engaging ad from these professionally designed layouts. Keep it simple and attractive and add or change images, text and elements. Then once you've finished with designing your Facebook ad, head up to the top right hand side of Canva and click download to download your Facebook ad. The second Facebook ad design tool is called InVideo. Click the link in the description and that will take you to the InVideo dashboard. Here we can simply create engaging video ads instead of a static image. InVideo allows you to use professional layouts and stock videos, or you can upload your own videos, images, or elements. Just navigate along the right until you locate Facebook Carousel Ad and click to bring up the templates to choose from. Click on them to view the ad template and then select the template that you want to use. I will pop up a video in the link above which will take you to a more detailed video tutorial on how to get the most out of InVideo. And those are our four vital activities that we use to create highly profitable Facebook ads for small businesses. It's important to practice each of the four activities that I covered today. And with practice and Facebook testing, your ads are going to become more profitable as you start understanding your audience, your ideal audience and their behavior on Facebook. And with that said, thank you for watching. I hope you gained valuable insight from today's video. If you did, make sure you leave a comment down below, subscribe, hit the thumbs up and share it with those that you believe will benefit from this video. Thank you for watching again and I will see you in next week's video. Take care.